Okay, so this is a quick video on groups of permutations. I want to get to the dihedral groups and this is not very exhaustive. I will I will do better videos uh, later on. Okay, so imagine we have a set. I'm going to call it A. And we have a couple of elements. Let's just say one, two, three, four, and five. Okay. What is a permutation here? Well, one permutation could be I'm going to put the elements here. Could be, for instance, so each element goes to one element. One could go to four, two could go to two, three to go to five, four to three, and five to one, for instance. Okay? So what we have here is a... I'm going to write it. A... permutation of a set A is a function that takes from A to A. Okay? And that is what a, permut a permutation of a set is. At the end of the day is a function. Okay? Um, this function has to be bijective, so it has to be one to one and onto. Okay? Injective and surjective too. So, quick example. Um, well, we can go back to, to, to this example. We take the same set. What was the set? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, and five elements in this set and um, so we are going to take a sigma permutation okay sigma is going to be one permutation so we write sigma in a more standard notation okay uh, changing the columns and the rows um, in parentheses in, uh, and omitting the, the arrows. This, this, this small arrows here are going to be omitted. Okay. So, I'm going to do... So, sigma, it's one permutation, will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I took um, 1 to 4, 2 to 2, 3 to 5, etc. So, the standard notation, notation is 1 to 4, 2 to 2, 3 to 5, 4 to 3, and 5 to 1. Okay? So, this is the standard notation for this. This is exactly the, the same. Okay? Get used because this is the language of group theory. Okay? Now, the notate, since, since this is a function, we say sigma 1 equals 4. So, 1 is the object and 4 will be the image. Okay? And sigma 2 equals 2. Okay? Now, <coughs> I'm going to take... Um, I'm going to rewrite first the first uh, permutation we took so one two three four five it is four two five three one okay this is sigma and now I'm going to, to do another one a thou one okay thou will be one two three four five And let us say three, five, four, two, one, for instance. Okay. Okay. Question: 
what will sigma tau will be? It will be the product of both. So this is sigma. And this is tau. And what does this equals to? So, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So, one, let's begin with one. One goes to four, and four goes to two. Okay. One. But uh, we are going to start with tau. Uh, well, the books, sometimes there is these um, different notations and uh, different conventions for this, this product, okay? But here I'm going to use um, uh, the more, the, the classical one. I'm going to say tau. So one, one goes to three. Okay, so I want sigma of tau of one. Tau of one is three, so I want sigma of three, and sigma of three is five. Okay, so one goes to five. Now I want two, so sigma tau two. Sigma tau of two is five. So sigma 5, sigma 5 is 1, so 2 goes to 1. Okay, now sigma tau three of 3, tau of 3 is 4, so it will be sigma of 4, and sigma of 4 is 3, so it will be 3. Okay, so 5, 1, 3, 2, four and here you are okay so we are multiplying in uh, right right to left okay this is we are multiplying right to left order some books do it the other way okay but we are going to adopt this convention here okay so if you have a set a set a a non empty set Okay, S of A will be the, the collection of all permutations of A. Okay, then we can say that S of A uh, is a group under permutation multiplication okay you can check it's it's easy to, 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 to check that this is a group obviously the identity is going to be uh, for instance one two three four five the identity oh sorry the identity will be one two three four five that's that's really easy to do all this Okay, you can check that uh, S of A is a group under uh, permutation uh, multiplication. Okay, I'm not going to get into the inverse now because that will that will take us. Uh, that will be again a problem with the convention of this and all that sort of thing. And and I want to move on because I want to get to the the, the dihedral group. Okay, so. We can say that um, if um, A if A is a finite set, okay, like one, two, etc., till uh, a a fixed n, okay. Uh, we say that the group of all permutations of A, so I'm going to write it, 
the the group of all permutations of a the group of all permutation of a is the symmetric group on n letters okay and we denote it by s n okay letters are like the elements of the the, the set i will explain this later okay uh, next video i'm going to get into two important um, examples for this um, symmetric uh, groups. <laughs>